Hello, beautiful family. How are you doing? Thank you for your love. Thank you for your support. So, my wonderful family, hey, you will not believe. A lot has happened recently. A lot happened. Uh, within 24 hours, Barrister Lloyd Jemako has released a lot of things. In fact, I first of all want you to listen to the announcement that they got to make. Then, we will talk at the end of the press briefing. Follow me. Good evening. Ladies and gentlemen of the press, and good evening to everyone listening out there. My name is Aloy Jumako. I'm a legal practitioner and special counsel to Mazenam de Kano and the indigenous people of Biafra, which are the subject matters of this press briefing and public announcement today in Enugu, Enugu State, Eastern Nigeria. The press briefing is in the form of a public announcement, as I stated before. I have reduced it in writing on my letterhead because of the sensitive nature of the message it bears. And the press briefing and the public announcement is going to be exactly to the script. So now, therefore, I'll read from the script I have prepared. So I'll stay within context. This is a public announcement stroke, press statement, issued by Maze Namdekano through my humble self, Aloy Ijmako, his special counsel and is issued to the general public and all media institutions. The subject matter of this public announcement is that by direct order, Mazin Namdekanu hereby ends once and for all and finally all sit at home, including the Monday sit at home and any other proposed sit at home presently in process. This public announcement, as written, bears the unedited verbatim instructions containing a direct order personally issued by Mazin Nandekano in his own handwriting on 24th July in the year of our Lord 2023 through my humble self to Marcy Simon Epa, instructing him to, quote, desist from calling for any sit at home henceforth, and to make a public announcement on his platform, media platform, to the effect that he, Marcy Nambekano, is in, no, he, Marcy Simon Epa, is in receipt of a direct order from him, Marcy Nambekano to cancel any pending sit at home in place at the moment. And also that he, Mazin Namdekan, has by the same order authorized me, Barista Aloy Ijmako, to issue a press statement if he, Mazin Simon Ekba, fails to make this announcement on his platform. For avoidance of doubt, this direct order to Mazin Simon Epa was personally handed to me by Mazin Nandekano when I visited him on the 24th of July, 2023, at the headquarters of the Department of State Security Services in Abuja, Umwai, Abuja, Nigeria, sorry, DSS. Later that day, I tried to contact Mazin Simon Epa via his WhatsApp number, but could not reach him until 1.44 a.m. the following day on the 25th of July, whereupon I snapped the direct order as written and sent to him on WhatsApp. He thereafter acknowledged receipt, and we spoke briefly on it and exchanged a couple of text messages thereof. Since that early 25th July 2023, when I conveyed the order to Marzi Eba, and he duly acknowledged receiving it. 
he has not implemented the order or otherwise made such, such public announcement on his media platform. Nonetheless, I made a conscious decision to give him the benefit of the doubt and thereby accord him time to do the need for. Then late yesterday, further written instructions was issued by Mazen Namdekano directly to me by proxy, referring to the extant direct order to Mazi Eba, and in addition instructing me that given that Mazi Eba has so far not carried out the order, I, Aloy Ejimako, as of council and as of today, the 25th of July, 2023, must proceed to make the order public through a written public, as, um, public announcement and press statement and whatnot. If you notice yesterday, the letter that was circulated said, uh, Mazina Dekan is even appreciating uh, the governors in South Eastern part of Nigeria that they are working on his behalf. Did uh, Mazis and Monekman know what they are doing on his behalf? So I was thinking that those type of things is going to be in public, like during this announcement that he is reading uh, the letter that Mazna the Kanu sent. He would have also read that for, for the world to see, not just on writing. He would have written it very boldly, saying, oh, uh, Mazna the Kanu is praising the, uh, the, the governors in such a part of Nigeria that they are doing a great job on his behalf. But nonetheless... This is the write-up from Barista Loy Jimako saying that uh, this is the number on the stream shot that uh, belongs to uh, the poor soul. He then he tagged uh, Simon Ekba, uh, paid to call me throughout last night. He said Simon Ekba paid this person to be disturbing him throughout last night. Uh, that uh, they, they, they could not sleep, Simon Ekba could not sleep, and the paid injured also could not also sleep. And also, he went further to say that the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra IPOP, now the Kanu's family, has confirmed that the handwriting letter displayed by Kanu's uh, special counsel, Aloy Ejimako, that ended sit at home in the southeast was actually written by Mazinam the Kanu. Then he ended up by saying, over to you, Ash Sabo Simonekba the liar. Ah, ah. I am like, what is all this? So this happened when the media has this, we are saying that uh, Simonekba said they should disregard the letter, that the letter is fake, the letter is not from Mazinam the Kanu. Will anybody blame Simonekba? Because Simonekba know the type of person that Mazina the Kano is. In fact, a lot of people that are not even Biafra, they were confirming that the letter is fake, that Mazina the Kano cannot write this. That if Mazina the Kano is writing this type of letter, that means there is two ways to it. Now, let's also see the conversation between Mazi Simon Ekba and Barista Aloy Ejimako. He said, if I may request, you can simply do a tweet alongside these lines. Then he go for that to say, notice after due considerations and consultions with Onye Dumazina de Kanu, true trusted and secured shining, a firm decision has been made that the purpose sit at home is hereby suspended until further notice no question about it and order from above now mazi simon yakpa responded and said i will address this no worries can i have this well typed out can i see the words clearly i mean the written instructions then barista lawyer jimako respond this way and said okay there is Plots, as you know, for so long now is to put you on collision captured with Onyendu. He has so far frustrated them from 
his angle. You should do uh, you should do likewise. If DOS disobey him, he does not expect expect you to do like them. This is a clear evidence. This is what Barrister Aloy Jimako wrote to Mazi Simon Ekpa. This is that discussion, in fact. This is all what they discuss. So why calling Sabo and all that? Why bring it things that are not necessary? Even if Mazina they cannot give an order to stop the sit at home. You know, like the relationship with Simon Ekma and Mazina the Kanu, hmm, he will never accept it because he knows who the father is. He knows that everything that Mazina the Kanu is passing through in that place, hey, or anything he's saying, hmm, he's saying it because he's there. That is why he said if they want him to obey any word that Mazina the Kanu is saying, then Mazina the Kanu should be in his family compound or in London passing order to him then he will obey that as long as Mazina the Kanu is still in that place that he will never obey or listen to anybody that is saying that and he went for that to say that and when Barrister Lord Jimako reached out to him Barrister Lord Jimako wants him to even speak to the governor of uh Enugu State okay and he said no Biafra struggle is not negotiable. But I'm so surprised that some uh, Nigerian media houses are saying that it's Simon Ekpa that is trying to speak to the governor of Enugu state. For what? So my colonialistic people, you see all these things that is happening. It's so painful that the people that you love at times, they use them against you. I don't really get it. But Mr. Lord Mako is one person that I've really loved. In fact, not that I do not still love him. I still love him. But all these things that is just tying around him and all that. Ah, imagine why uh, Barry Stefan is your is just trying to withdraw himself from all those things all these things if you notice the press a uh, briefing of a uh, barrister if i in asia for he made one statement that only do send some people to issue something to simon Ekma, but they did not say it so now everything is beginning to be so clear that they disobey now the canon and all that they don't want to pass out the message and all that okay the one that mazina they can pass out to them why did they not obey it now, Mazina the Kanu is saying uh, from uh, Mazina Simonekpa own a uh, platform, his own media platform. Hmm. What happened to um, the radio Biafra that Mazina the Kanu said they should give him a, a slot and they refused? Why did Mazina the Kanu not put all those things in writing and say that, okay, oh, uh, they should allow him to speak to the people with radio Biafra? Yes! That is the way it should be because with Radio Biafra, people will hear very well. Why is on platform? I don't get it. If this thing is for Biafra and it's going well, well, it should be on Radio Biafra, not its platform. This is when Mazina the Kanu will know that, okay, the time I said they should give Mazina the Mazina Samonet Pass Law, they did not give to him. Where will he pass this message? Hey, where will he pass this message? This message should have been passed on Radio Biafra. Yes! Simon Ekpa will pass this message on one condition on Radio Biafra because that is where everybody will listen. Yes, so Simon Ekpa is going to pass this message on Radio Biafra. Yes, that is where everybody will listen. Not his own personal platform. Which platform? Did he have any platform again? The one that uh, he have, the YouTube channel that he had before, is that. So I don't even know where he's making his book up. But if it's on Radio Biafra, hey, everybody will listen. This message will be passed on radio biafra yes on radio biafra hey hey whoa please do want to share this video share it please let it go viral that mazi simon Ekpa will pass this message on radio biafra yes so radio biafra that is the that is the shyness going to use on radio biafra hey, hey. wahala he where did he want to pass the message which which media platform if he passes in his own platform, everybody will not hear now. But if he's already a Biafra, everybody will hear because the IPOP family, they are using Radio Biafra to pass out their message. So it's on Radio Biafra that is going to pass out this message. I don't know how many of you is going to agree with me on this, but we need that Radio Biafra. 
is there that you go and pass this message oh koko bioko <laughs> please share this video please just share it because the headline said that he should use his own personal platform why did Mazda the canon really specify that he should use his own personal platform instead of radio biafra ah, ah. there are so many things there are so many things to this why not radio biafra so please share this video and let it go viral. I don't know how many people that still resist this, the one I'm resisting it, but the truth will be coming out gradually. As for me, I started the motion by saying that Mazina the Kanu know that the radio that he left behind is, is Radio Biafra. And he know that Radio Biafra is where they worship. And any message that is coming must pass through the Radio Biafra. So why did he specify that uh, Mazin Samonekma should not go to Radio Biafra, should use his own plat personal platform? No, he should use Radio Biafra. Yes, he should use Radio Biafra to make this broadcast. Ah, ah. It is just coming to my mind that the quick asset, the quick way, the quick place to make this this announcement should be on Radio Biafra. I don't know how many of you agree with me about on me. Hey, it's going to be on Radio Biafra. We are going to hear the voice of the Prime Minister in that Radio Biafra to make any announcement they want him to make. Must be on Radio Biafra. That is where I am standing right now. <laughs> it will be on Radio Biafra, not his own personal platform. Which personal platform? Mazna the Kanu is aware that the platform of Simon Ekpa is not is it, 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 it's not worldwide. Let me use that word. Yes, so. And he know that the radio that he left behind is the one that is connected to all the connectable. So why did he not say that they should Give him the spot to make this thing on Radio Biafra. Why is your personal platform? That is what. So my family, I just say, let me drop my own little opinion that why is on personal platform? Why not on Radio Biafra? Ah uh, ah. Uh, please drop your opinion in the comment section because me, I see stand by saying that it should go to Radio Biafra. If they want him to make any announcement, it should be on Radio Biafra. So thank you so much, everyone, for listening. Please drop your opinion also in the comment section. And bye bye.